sheriff who became one of the faces of the Roden murder investigation finds himself accused of a crime. A grand jury indicted Pike County Sheriff Charlie Reeder today. Local 12's Anjanette Levy broke the news of the charges on Twitter and she has details on the allegations. This is the 16 count indictment filed against Sheriff Charlie Reeder. We reported back in December that Reeder was under criminal investigation, but we learned today that he's been under scrutiny for at least a year. They left traces. They left a trail. That was Sheriff Charlie Reeder last Our November, announcing the arrest of the Wagners for the Roden the family documents. murders. The brutal killings thrust Reeder into the national spotlight. We have obsessively focused on solving this case. But today, seven months later at the Pike County Courthouse, a grand jury indicted the sheriff on 16 counts, eight felonies and eight misdemeanors. Everything from tampering with evidence involving evidence envelopes, theft in office, securing writings by deception, and conflict of interest. Any indictment involving felonies against a public official, especially a county sheriff, is a serious indictment. Special Prosecutor Robert Smith with the Ohio Auditor's Office says all of the crimes were committed in Reader's official capacity as sheriff. I'd rather not discuss the details of what it's related to, but you do have the original complaint and now you have the indictment, so you can connect the dots. Last November, this complaint was filed with the Auditor's Office. It claimed Reader stole money seized in drug cases from a safe in his office and that he was taking cars from the impound lot to be used by his family. The anonymous person wrote that employees were scared to death of him. Reader's also accused of taking loans from sheriff's employees. He's never been camera shy, but today he wouldn't comment about the allegations when we went to the sheriff's office. And his attorney also declined to comment, but a sheriff's spokesman had this to say. The sheriff is making sure that the deputies are going to continue to respond to calls here in the county. And the citizens should rest assured that their calls are still going to be answered for service. Sheriff Reeder will enter a plea to these charges here at the Pike County Courthouse on Tuesday. Sheriff Reeder has not been convicted of a crime, so he can remain sheriff, but it's not clear at this point whether the Democratic Party here in Pike County will ask him to step aside. In Waverly, Anjanette Levy, Local 12 News. Ohio Attorney General David Yost says Reeder's indictment will not impact the Wagner cases at trial because he wouldn't be called as a witness. Sources have told Local 12 that he did not play a role in the investigation.